what is going on guys welcome back to the channel panthers advice today man if you haven't already heard frank Reich, he is up out of there so what does that mean now for the panthers new interim head coach is chris t the special teams coach thomas b jim cogwell they will be handling the play calling duties now this is where things get interesting if we look at the schedule for the panthers next week is the bucks saints falcons packers jags and the bucks again in the last week that's going to be something to watch how does the team improve from week 13 to week 18, right? That's going to be something to keep your eye on. On top of that, remember I said Jags. Jags are week 17. Now, it wasn't that long ago where the Jags had the number one overall pick. They took Trevor Lawrence. And how did Trevor Lawrence do? 12 touchdowns, 17 interceptions. 12 touchdowns, 17 interceptions, all right? What happened, right? What happened between then... First now. Well, remember then they took Mr. Urban Meyer and then he brought in Mr. Tim Tebow. Everybody was all hype, right? And look what happened. Same thing happened with Carolina. We brought in Frank. We drafted Bryce. Look what happened. And I had the mistake of not looking at Frank's film before the season started. Once you look at Frank's film from any game, any game, you'll see that was never going to work. Frank's offense is probably a decade, two decades too old. It probably worked 10, 15 years ago, 20 years ago. It's not going to work anymore. It, it's just not going to work anymore. The defenses have evolved. They're much faster, stronger, and there's no run game. A lot of Frank's offense was predicated on the run game. The Panthers didn't have that, right? They brought in Miles Sanders, already had Blackshear, already had Hubbard. Not sure why we did that. So with that being said, that's going to be something to watch. The Bucks, week 13 versus week 18. The Jags, one of the best teams in the AFC right now. How do we stack up against them? Give it a new play call after five weeks. Something to keep your eye on. But remember, Trevor Lawrence, 12 touchdowns, 17 interceptions his rookie year. And now look where he is. I'm not saying Bryce is going to be the same. I'm just trying to show you guys that having a good play caller that will use the QB to the best of his ability, it definitely matters as well as a good head coach. So coming tomorrow, we've got the Panthers-Titans post-game reaction. We're going to get to that tomorrow, along with answering a bunch of questions. So if you have any you want me to answer, put them in the comments below. Film study, what happened, right, versus the Titans. We're going to go over that. Mingo and Bryce. We're also going to talk about the defense because, man, once again, they gave the offense a chance to win the game, and we call a screenplay on fourth down. We're going to get to all that tomorrow. Stay tuned for that. More film study. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Panthers advice is out.